Optifine is uh, arguably the most popular Minecraft mod of all time. And in this video, we're going to show you how to get it on your Mac. From downloading it, to installing it, to running Minecraft with Optifine on your Mac, it's all going to be covered in this video. Now, first things first, before we even install Optifine, I want to mention Java. Later in this, we're going to open up the Optifine installer. And there's a potentiality that that does not work for you. It just does not open. Now, the main reason for that is probably because you don't have Java 17. So you need to come download and install Java 17. This is linked in the description down below and it goes over everything you need to know to get Java 17 in the description. Super simple tutorial, but it covers everything. You need Java 17 in order to install Optifine on Mac and it's the most common problem we see. But nevertheless, let's go ahead and get Optifine. So first things first, we wanna go ahead and go to the second link in the description down below. That will take you here. We're gonna click on the download Optifine button. That will take you to Optifine's official download page where you want to click on the mirror link under the version you want. If you want to see more versions, just click show all versions. As you can see, we have more here. Now, we do want to go ahead and click the preview versions if it's out because that's going to give you the most recent updated version. For example, if we want 1.19.3, we have to use preview versions. You probably won't even have that though. And if you don't, it's just versions listed, that's fine too. But no matter what, you want to then come under it and click mirror because that's going to bypass some ads and take you directly to that version's specific download page. Once you're here, click download and the download should begin after a few seconds. Now, one thing that is worth mentioning here is that you may need to keep or save this file depending on your browser. While it's downloading though, have a nice more sponsor, Apex Minecraft Hosting. Go to the first link in the description down below to break down .xyz slash Apex to start your very own 24-hour DDoS protected Minecraft server. Apex is the easiest way to start a Minecraft server on your Mac. You can make it public, you can make it private, and if you can play on any other server, like Hypixel for example, you'll be able to play on Apex. Nevertheless, go check them out at the first link in the description down below to break down .xyz slash Apex. Nevertheless, at this point, we can go ahead and close out of that. Optifine has been downloaded. You'll be able to find Optifine in your downloads folder here. I'm going to move it to our desktop just because it's ease of use, right? It's just easier for me to do this video if you can see it on my desktop. Nevertheless, though, once it's here, you can go ahead and just double click on it. Now, it's probably not going to work. That could be for a few reasons, but one of them is this. It's unidentified developer. Well, in that case, go ahead and click OK. Click OK again, and now what we want to do is go ahead and open up the system settings. Then once we're in system settings, we're going to scroll down on the left-hand side to privacy and security. And then finally on this page, scroll all the way down to the bottom to where you'll see this. Preview, Optifine.jar was blocked because it's not from an identified developer. Well, that's correct. Optifine's an indie product. They're not registering with Apple here, right? And so for that reason, we do need to click open anyway. I promise it's safe. You're watching me do it live in this video. We can type in our password here, and then we can go ahead and click modify settings. Once we do that, it's going to give us one more warning, and then click open. Finally, the Optifine installer is going to open except if it doesn't. And if it doesn't, that's where that Java 17 comes in that we mentioned on the front end. Go get Java, download it, install it, all that stuff, and then come back here and this will be good to go. By the way, if it's not Java 17, that's okay. Uh, that means Java's changed for Minecraft and you need a newer version. But nonetheless, once we're here, we wanna go ahead and click install. Now, the only reason this wouldn't work is, well, one, you have Minecraft open. If that's the case, close out of it. Two, you've never played the Minecraft version that you're installing Optifine for. In our case, that's 1.19.3. For you, that might be 1.20, 1.21. It doesn't matter what version it is. You've had to have played it on your Mac before you can install Optifine for it. Just go play it, open it to the main menu, close out of it, you'll be good to go. The other reason is that the Minecraft launcher is open. The Minecraft launcher is open, it also won't install. So there we go, Optifine's now successfully installed. Click OK, and it will close out of that. You can also delete Optifine from your desktop. The hard part is over at this point. We just need to open up the Minecraft launcher. And then once we're in the Minecraft launcher, we need to select our Optifine profile. Now, you should have this by default, right? You should have the Optifine profile. Uh, mine is, if we click this little arrow, right there, Optifine. Now, if you do have that, click on it, click play, click play again, you're good. But if you don't, click on installations. Then make sure modded is checked. As you can see, we uncheck modded, it disappears. We check modded, there it is. Now, Last but not least, if you still don't have Optifine or it's not the correct version, as you can see, if 1.19.3, if it's 1.18 instead of 1.19.3, for example, we want to click New Installation. Then we can name this wherever you want. I'm going to name it Mac 2023 Optifine Guide. Then we want to go ahead and change our version. Now, this is the most important part. You want to make sure it's release Optifine for whatever version you want. That could be 1.20, 1.30, 1.19. Doesn't matter. Just make sure it's release Optifine. Then we can change our resolution. You don't have to do that. I'm just doing it so you can see once we get in game and then click create. Now we have this new Mac Optifine guide where we can cover over it, click play, click play again, and Minecraft will open up with Optifine installed. It's that simple. It's that easy to get Optifine up and running on Mac OS. 
from here you can add shaders and all that stuff and actually if you want to see how to add shaders we have an in-depth video on how to do that on mac os as well how do we know optifine is working though well if we click options video settings we'll be able to see all of the optifine settings here we also have videos on how to set up optifine and how to make sure it you know is less laggy and all that stuff and guess what all of that stuff works on mac os as well so be sure to go check out those videos anyway my name is nick this has been the breakdown thanks for watching we'll see you in the next one peace